Liv. Hang on. You think I don't know what this is about, but I do. Really? Yeah, and right now your head's probably all over the place wondering what's going to happen next. Yeah, I guess. We've got nothing to worry about. We're only looking into me adopting Seb, and it's not going to change anything. Seb? Well, Rebecca's gone, so I'm just trying to do the right thing. You're not going to get pushed out, I promise you. <sighs> Liv. Don't you remember being 16? I was angry just because I was meant to be angry. No, it was more than that. She almost looked disappointed in me. Well, if I had a pound for everyone who's ever looked disappointed in me... You've been brave! You've been brave! You've been brave! Stop now. <laughs> a special occasion here, Jimmy. Uh, yeah. Gabby's got her GCSE results. She's passed, but right now I think she wishes she'd failed. I'm so sorry. It's fine. No, it's not. I, I even had the date written down on my phone. Did you? Why didn't you tell me? There's me going on about Seb. It's not a big deal, seriously. Right, stop being nice. It makes it worse. I'd rather you kick off with us. Or you could just tell us how you've done. I failed. OK, how many? How many? I failed all of them. Right, well, I didn't do much better and I'm doing all right. Ish. Yeah, and there's, there's always resits. What, so I can mess up again? When I open the envelope, a tiny, tiny part of me thought, well, you never know. But guess what? If I mess my own life up, I get top marks. Liv. Architecture. Yes. Is this going to take long? That was said on the phone. Just need to ask a few questions. Why did you tell the security firm that their services were no longer required? My boss didn't think it was worth the expenditure. Has he got plans for the site? There are ideas in the pipeline. And I'm guessing you're insured against uh, eventualities such as these? Of course we are. And you were on site prior to the fire. Did you um, see anything suspicious? No, but I did see... What? Lachlan White. Uh, he used to live on the estate. And you saw him near the cabin? Well, he said he was going for a run, but... Have you reason not to believe him? I just think it's him you should be talking to, not insinuating an insurance job. Mr Tate is a very rich man. He doesn't need to claim money back on a burnt-out shack. I'm not insinuating anything. We have an obligation to investigate all avenues, and since we have reason to believe that the fire was started deliberately, we have to question what anyone would stand to gain from that. So it was started on purpose? This wasn't an accident? Over here. I think you need to take a look at this. I've got a scent and dug this up. I think it's blood. Right, we need forensics here now. 